guys and welcome back again to my YouTube channel Flavin here. How are you guys doing? I hope you are doing alright. So in today's video, I am taking you guys around Yupwe. If you don't know Yupwe, it is a village around, around Douala. So we are already at the market here. This is where you can buy fish in pork. You can buy a lot of sea related things. Okay. As you can see, there is water just behind me. People travel from different places. So I just want to bring you guys along. Come with me. Come and know more about you. If you want to visit this place, you know, to just live and enjoy yourself, then this is the right place. Without talking too much, let's just go straight into this video. Okay guys, so this is the water area. This is where people travel. This is where you see most of the boats. This is where you see, see, this, I'm enter boat today. <laughs> I must enter one of these boats today. Okay, so this is just another area of UP. This is where you see the boats coming from different places. They come here, you know, they bring passengers. This is where you see them coming with fish and all of that good stuff. Okay, this is not the only place I'm going to be showing you about UP. We are going to go round. Okay, we are going to be going round. But this is the best part here, okay? We've started here already. We have started here already. to visit the market where they sell fish because this place right here is where you can buy fresh fish in bulk, dry fish in bulk, crayfish in bulk and since I went there late I didn't really see fresh fish but I had to go to the other section where you can get dry fish and crayfish and we talked to somebody who you know explain better what they do at UP and how to get fish so you guys should just listen. Madam Tagen Bridget Presently, I live in UP for more than 26 years in fish business. In fish business. And UP is known as a fishing port where people do it, they do drying and killing. And so we have the varieties of fish that they sell here. You have the you have the pest class, which is Mbonga, you have Bilolo, you have other types of fish like mullet, solet and other many types of fish many types of fish that we sell here and any price any fish is liable to a price at time they used to count mbonga when it is cheap you know that when it is being produced much that is when they produce are much we say they sell it in a moderate price but when it is in scarcity the price changes at times you can get 10 but in a month time, when, they, when they, they, the products are not much, they sell it at 8. When we talk of 10, we mean 20, 10 in pairs. And when we talk of 8, we talk 12, uh, uh, 8 in, in pairs. It depends on the, the season of the fish, of the, the, the fishing. We have other ones that like we call ourselves here, like the transformatrix. We buy it fresh, and then we do, we do the drying. We transform it to another way. Because here, like this one, when, we, when it is fresh, it's long. The way we want to transform it in a different way, we burn it before drying. Then there's also njanga. They call it, yeah, they call it njanga, crazy fish. And so the crazy fish, they kill it at the combo. People go and buy in bags, they come and retail. Some people are doing the wholesale market. Even the bonga that people are buying, they go and do the, the wholesale market. They come here and then the retailers come from up and then they come to buy. People are coming from Bamenda, Bakusam and Yawude and so forth. Some of the challenges is that we don't have very good areas of, uh, of keeping our, our produce. Sometimes insects enter inside there because there is no help. At least they have to come here and be doing cleanliness and then they, they spray some anti insect uh, uh, medicine. But we are just selling here, we don't have those mixes to take care of our, and then we don't have good drying. 
because we don't have ovens. Uh, I'm wishing everybody to come here in Upe to come and buy food because this is the biggest market in the whole Douala that is doing wholesale. Because when we go and buy from the river, from the seaside, we bring it here and people come and buy here because sometimes there are difficulties by going to the water. So people who do not know how to enter inside the sea and buy fish, they can come here in Upe and buy their fish. It will be safer for them. Okay guys, so I just finished from the fish market, showing you guys the different types of fish. You see people heard what Mama Bridget had to say. So I want to see if I can enter a boat. Remember I told you guys the last time I was at Bona Samada, I would love to enter a boat one day. So I want to just see if I can enter a boat. <laughs> About to go on a boat ride to come with me. I'm about to enjoy myself. I told you guys that one day <laughs> me and must enter a boat. Today is that day, okay? Ah, uh, it's a little bit expensive, but it is worth the experience. At least I'll click it off my bucket list that I entered a boat. So we are going right now, and I'm just going to bring you guys along. Is it like a little? No, no. I said, what's up? No, I can't do that. Boat. <laughs> ah, <laughs> <laughs> okay. I thought in my mind that I was scared, but it's all just scared of the nature and I'm enjoying every bit of it. Okay, this is this is so good. I'm not lying, I can feel small. <laughs> but it's worth the experience. Look at this, this is so good. This has been my tour guy of the day. He has been amazing, okay? When I'm done here, I'm going to take his number so that when you guys want to come to Ukraine, I'm going to send you to him because he has been amazing. plenty things guys this is nature at its finest okay there are times that i just felt like in my life i needed this point you know to just experience some things that i never experienced to just do things that i've never done before like that's the whole purpose of this youtube channel okay just documenting my life some of the things that i've not been able to do i'm just going to do it now i'm so so grateful this is so nice so nice you guys should try this if you want peace of mind, your mental health, you just want to cool, relax, okay? This is a very good exercise. Seriously, I thought that I would be scared, but this is good. <laughs>
We're going to we're going outside Hotel Marina. Okay, so we are going to Hotel Marina here at UK. Okay, I heard that it's a beautiful place, so I want to go and see it so that if it's very, very nice, I can show you guys around. So, if you want to come to UK, you know, just have fun like me or just enjoy the boat ride, then you can always at least you know that there's a place for you to lodge. Okay, the purpose was to come and show you. If this vlog is too long, I'm going to split it into two parts. Okay, but I said now I am just having fun i have spent a lot but it is okay it is okay at least i'm having fun i'm just enjoying myself okay so yeah let's go to the hotel and i want to also show other amazing places so if i see other amazing places i am going to show you guys so that if you're coming to up at least you know that there are touristic sites for you to you know visit and all that good stuff okay so let's go <laughs> their new market here okay they are going to leave that area where i started my vlog so as you can see construction is presently going on so when they are done here everybody is going to transfer and come here so that if you want to come and eat fish when they are done this will be the area i'm just showing you guys their new market it will soon be done yes i cannot wait when they do this new market i'm going to come back here and eat fish but right now i'm going to hotel marina guys if i tell them i say my heart me caught at the life but i'm enjoying it this is really good yeah so this is going to be the new market let me stop filming before they can't make her 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 go all team for the ukraine and her now we ship this uh -huh. then what it happen It don't spoil us, boy. Ha! I feel say it capsize na capsize. It is waka. Five years this thing has been standing here. It's not working. Nothing. And they never still move on for here. Uh -huh. Mhm. Mm Ice. Okay, they fabricate ice around here. Okay. And for here. Oh wow. So people they can buy ice for here. <laughs> So 
bring them. Right. Guys, so right now I'm going to Hotel Marina to show you guys how it looks like. I'm working with my tour guy. If I cannot show you guys how it looks like, know that they did not grant me access to shoot into it, okay? So yes, Ay, the sun has been slapping my face really well. Ay, that boat ride was, <laughs> it was something else. I'm going to give my, my review later on, but let's just go to Hotel Marina now. Guys, this is a good place to come and have fun. They call it as a song with the guest for the Dwala. Yes, this is how it looks like. I'm just going to go in. We have playgrounds, kids friendly. So if you're coming with your family, this is a perfect place to come and have fun. Oh, say see. Wow. Yes, guys, this is a playground. This is where horses. Now, horses. Yes. Okay, this is where horses usually play. Oh, I'm early. If only I'll be here till evening, I will show you guys. If only I come here till evening, okay? Yes. Hey, guys, do you see how tired I look? It's not been easy. But this place is actually really nice. Like, I'm seeing they want to have a birthday party over there. It's really cool, you know. If you want to even have, come and have your birthday party, just come here. This place is really amazing. Yeah. At least for its standards, it's not bad. <laughs> for you, for standards, it's not bad. Okay, you guys can come here and have fun. I want to have a drink. See, I don't have a work of a son. I just need to have, even if it's one matter. Hey, they leave me my drink so that now nah, I feel free. Guys, I do not even drink in that area. They told me that I have to buy what is one book for 5,000. Who yeah. book 5,000 help? I beg. One book of five times before what I have a ticket inside. I don't even understand how it works. I beg. I just wanted a drink. I just wanted a drink. Even if they have said it's one thousand, that would be okay. So let's see if I can go to Hotel Marina now and just check it out. Welcome to Hotel Marina. Guys, welcome to Hotel Marina. I love this little thing here coming out. Yes, this is how it looks like. We are just moving in. I'm going to get a drink, okay? Yes, I want to also say that I just noticed they have a playground, which is good. If you have kids, you know, it's kids friendly, you can come here. The place looks quiet, clean, you know, just beside the ocean. Do you guys see the water there? So we're just going to go now and have a drink. I'm loving the playground. It looks really clean, nice, and it's like it's well maintained. So if you want to bring your kids here, you have nothing to be worried about that. Probably they will not have a place to play. Yeah, this looks good. Restaurant à côté. So we are going to the restaurant. Did you guys see the water? That is where I was with my boat. <laughs> that is where I came from. So right now I'm going to the restaurant area. Hopefully I can see the manager and do a proper um, tour of this place. We check the rooms and all of that, but it's not today. That is a story for another day, okay? Yes, yeah, so I'm going to the restaurant area now, but I must look for the management before I leave. I promise to do that. So that we do a proper um, hotel tour, we do a proper review of their rooms. If it's favorable for you guys to come and lodge, and enjoy yourself when you come to Ukraine. Then my drink is there. Finally, I get to drink that Malta. I could not wait again. I just have to drink. Like it's been a rough day. Hey guys, so I am currently at Hotel Marina. Okay, yeah, at Ukraine. Yes, it's been a long day. The sun has been slapping my face really well, <laughs> but it's been worth it. Okay, the experience has been great. I'm just here to get a drink to calm down to calm myself because this one has been dealing with me so like i said i'm going to look for the management and ask if it's okay for us to do a proper tour of the hotel you know to just another day it may not be today yes this video is already too long so i'm sitting here just beside the ocean do you guys see that's the water behind me so this is the perfect place if you're coming to Yupwe and you just want to have that um, breath of fresh air beside the ocean this is the perfect place. See me, I'm already selling their markets when they have not paid me. <laughs> 
yeah so this place is really good oh, see they have buffet i they have drinks here and when you come here your drink is not your normal thing sang me frank drink okay my matter cost one five which is i don't really mind it's still okay the place doesn't look bad yet yet i've not i've not seen anything negative that can really say it looks calm nice but i learned that you know during the weekends like saturday sunday if you come here the population is really going to be there but i choose not to come those days because you guys know excuse me when you come here people will be like oh don't feel me don't feel me so it's good to come days where you don't have population so that you can properly talk you can do you know good reviews yeah so yes i don't know this is where i was passing with my boat already okay and let's just drink <laughs> okay guys i'm done with my malta the matter that you guys saw me drinking a drink here it's not that expensive shall one five it's, it's okay for me because we have been to places where matter is something else when you look at the place you don't really see it so i i took my malta for 1500 francs so i'm leaving hotel marina now but i spoke to somebody asking them if they can let me do a proper you know review of their place of their restaurant of their hotel because i learned that this is one of the best in this area okay so yes i'm leaving now i want to go and look for fish <laughs> where i can eat fish because if i start asking these hotel people to give me fish they'll start making me one kind i'm going to you know the local areas the places where you can come and eat fish but i learned that um this today is not saturday yes you will not see the place booming you will not see people eating fish but i'm still going to show you guys where you can eat fish and i i made a mistake when i was showing the market i didn't really show you guys fresh because before i came they don't buy all fish just few and people were already taking it so i could not really film fresh fish okay so yeah so right now i'm just going to go to somewhere that i can get local i can get um you know fish roasted fish and just have fun yeah so you guys should just come along this video is already too long if you guys want me to do a proper hotel review you know show you guys because i loved their restaurant it was looking amazing amazing it was really nice it wasn't looking too um classy and all of that but it was looking good okay yeah so we are leaving hotel marina now and i'm just going to look for fish maybe after fish the vlog is over your girl got to go home <laughs> so this is normally where people come and eat fish you guys see this place behind me how do you say they come and eat fish but now because it is not saturday or friday i cannot eat fish okay i cannot eat fish so i'm going to another place to look for fish but locally this is where you come this is where it, it really booms <laughs> friday saturday sunday this is where you come and eat fish okay look at me i'm just beside the river so this place is just beside the water it's going to give you that fresh air i passed this place when i was doing my boat ride okay and that is hotel marina that's where i'm coming from right over there yes so guys i'm going to another place right now okay just look at this view look at this view nature is good cameroon gave fine places sharp yeah so i'm just going now to another place i must eat fish i want to taste fish in europe i must know how it tastes like okay yes guys so let's just go i don't tire already no fish to eat here no fish to eat here dwala na just water also have a dwala na water some of the homes of the fishermen they just live around here this is life in UP oh simple and nice oh, never forget they mean yes guys since I could not find fish in that area I'm just going to eat my fish here now <laughs> let us taste you play fish let's know how you play. people make their own fish okay this is really really nice I'm going to eat it either with plantain or bobolo. Street food in Yupwe. So if you're looking for good street food, she's not just she's not far from that area. Yeah, she's not very far from that area. So we are going to enjoy our fish now, and I'll keep you guys posted. <laughs> Okay, I'm going 
back home in Bonaberry. But this is where the vlog ends. Comment down below what was your favorite part in this vlog. If you enjoyed this vlog like I did, I'm sorry if it's a little bit too long. Let me know down in the comment section below. Okay, anything that you guys want me to change, just comment down below and let me improve. And also, this is me saying that if you are a business person, you have a business, a hotel, a guest house, a resort, a restaurant, or anything, and you want me to come and shoot videos and do reviews of your place, hit me up. All my in my information are going to be down in the description box. Okay, let us work together and show Cameroon to the world. Okay, so thank you guys so much for watching. Please don't forget to hit on that red subscribe button, like, comment, share, and all that good stuff. And I'm going to see you in my next video. Bye. Bye.